हे गाइस डू यू नो व्हाट एग्जैक्टली आर मिल सिल पिल हिल डिल एंड विल टेस्टिंग मेथड्स इन ऑटोमोटिव वेलकम टू आवर डीप डाइव इनटू ऑटोमोटिव टेस्टिंग टुडे वी आर एक्सप्लोरिंग सिक्स क्रूशियल मेथोडोलॉजीज मॉडल इन द लूप सॉफ्टवेयर इन द लूप प्रोसेसर इन द लूप हार्डवेयर इन द लूप ड्राइवर इन द लूप एंड व्हीकल इन द लूप these stages ensures that automotive systems are safe reliable and cutting edge before hitting the road well let's get started mill model in the loop our first stage is model in the loop or mill in mill both the plant which represents the vehicle dynamics and the controller which houses the control algorithms are fully simulated this early testing phase allows engineers to develop and redefine algorithms without the need for any hardware by using virtual models designers can quickly iterate on control strategies simulate various scenarios and identify issues early on it's a cost effective way to validate ideas before any physical prototypes are built sil software in the loop next we have software in the loop or sil at this stage the plant is still simulated but the controller is now the actual software code that has been written and compiled For example, if SIL is developed in Simulink, you will find S functions inside the controller. SIL bridges the gap between theoretical design and practical implementation. Testing the actual code within a virtual plant environment helps developers catch software bugs, verify algorithm accuracy, and ensures that the code behaves as expected before it ever meets hardware. PIL processor in the loop. Processor in the loop or PIL adds another layer of realism. While we continue using simulated plant, the controller code now runs on the target processor or microcontroller. This is crucial for evaluating the real-time performance and execution characteristics of your code. PIL testing verifies that the hardware can handle the computational demands of your software. It helps identify any timing issues. latency or performance bottlenecks that might occur once the system is deployed in a real world scenario hill hardware in the loop hardware in the loop or hill is where we bring in the real hardware the ecu although the plant model remains simulated the ecu operates in its true hardware configuration hill testing is critical because it validates the ecu's behavior in a controlled environment ensuring that it will perform reliably when integrated into the vehicle by simulating a variety of operational scenarios engineers can detect potential issues fine tune performance and guarantee that the system meets all safety and performance standards before full scale vehicle integration dil driver in the loop driver in the loop or dil introduce the human element into our testing process here a real driver interacts with a simulator that incorporates both the plant model and controller this approach is key to understanding how drivers respond to various driving conditions and it's particularly important for advanced driver assistance systems adas and autonomous vehicle testing dil helps engineers evaluate human machine interaction ensuring that the systems not only function correctly but also provides an intuitive and safe driving experience will vehicle in the loop finally we have vehicle in the loop or will this stage involves the testing the real vehicle while it interacts with a simulated environment will testing provides the ultimate validation by combining the complexity of real world vehicle with the control and repeatability of simulation it ensures that all systems from the ecu to the vehicle dynamics work together harmoniously under various simulated conditions such as different weather road types and traffic scenarios this comprehensive testing is the final step before a vehicle goes into production well to recap we explored the journey from simulation to real world validation in automotive testing starting with mill where both plant and controller are simulated moving through sil and pil for early software and hardware performance checks progressing to hill where the ecu meets its virtual environment then incorporating the human element with dil and finally validating the entire system with will each of these stages plays a critical role in ensuring that vehicles are safe reliable and ready for the road whether you are a developer engineer or just an automotive enthusiast 
Understanding these methodologies is a key to appreciating the complexity behind modern vehicle systems. Well, thank you for watching this video and have a great day.